Yo, what's going on everybody? Kuzu here, bringing you the final installment of the year of Tales of Symphonia. Basically, this is part C, catching up on whatever I couldn't catch up on last night while I was recording part B. Alright, so basically, what happened? Excuse me. So basically what happened, if you missed part A and B, we went through the Tower of Mana, fought the boss, got Undine, which they in-game pronounce Undini, which still bugs me. Let me load this in so we don't get hit with a copyright for the music. Alright, so, like I said, we got Undine, which they call Undini for some reason in game. Um, what else? We're uh, trying to finish up the healing stuff for Pietra to get him all healed up. Which is where we left off last night. Alright, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get the healing stuff. We're going to try and fight some of these hidden bosses that I skipped over last time on the way through certain areas. And we're gonna try and get self. And then we're gonna go through the Tower of Salvation. And then, for those of you guys who don't, who haven't played the game, you're going to be uh, going to be hit with some uh, some emotions. So yeah, without further ado, let's get this shit started. Alright, we're gonna go finish off the healing stuff. Which I was too tired to figure out last night. But basically, after you get the unicorn horn, you have to go back to the Tower of Mana and look at the books to get the information you need on how to uh, make a healing art out of the. Uh, Oh, yeah. yeah, Rain has resurrection as well now, so makes me happy. Turn that down a bit. Oh, I remember turning that down every time. Oh, yeah. I start recording. Demon light speed never stood a chance. Damn Kratos, you just did two arts back to back at the end. With no one there to hit. Alright. Alright, let's just get to the bridge. We can get out of here. Get to the tower, ride Noish. Go from there. We're gonna have to backtrack all the way back to Hema. Just to do some stuff. And then... Backtrack all the way back to uh, back to Dirk's house. Way back at the beginning of the game. There's some items that I'd rather get now than wait till later. So it should be this one right here. Yep. Boltzmann book. 
Oh, now we can save Pietro. Yes, we have the unicorn horn as well. So we should be able to do it. Boom. Ultimate recipe. Like, yeah, let's read that. Aww. I was gonna get some master recipe. That didn't help. Alright, so let's go save Pietro. Pietro! Pietro, Pedro, Peter. You're in Hema, right? Yep, let's go to Hema. Take me. Try it now. All right. Yes, please. Resurrection. But he's not dead. <laughs> Where am I? Woke up. Thank goodness. Sophia? Then I reached Hema. Yes, Pietro. Tina. He saved you. Yes, I remember. After leaving Luin, I was attacked by designs. Then she... Thank you so much. Uh, don't mention it. And besides, the reason you were getting consciousness is because of Rain here. You're going to thank us. If you're going to thank someone, thank her. Oh, I see. Thank you so much. Now I can await the Chosen. The Chosen? What do you mean? The reason I broke out of the ranch was because I have something I need to tell the Chosen. If you're looking for the Chosen, she's right here. What? It, you're the Chosen? Oh, Goddess Martell, thank you! Goddess? Huh? Man. The designs are trying to revive something called Angelus Project. They're also developing a weapon called the Mana Cannon. Mana Cannon? You mean Thor's Hammer? From Ancient War? I don't know the details. They're using things called x spheres in these sinister experiments. Please stop the Angelus Project with the power of the Chosen to save us all. Relax, we've defeated. Over. And we rescued the people who were held captive. It's because of that jewel you had. Is that true? I knew we could count on Chosen. I'm concerned about the mana cannon. Yeah. We won't get anywhere pondering it here. Can this technique be used to save Carla as well? Yes, I'm sure. We will be able to save that poor woman when we have the time. Thank you very much. But because of me, Luminous, I want to use this life that you saved to rebuild Luin. When I regain a little more strength, I intend to travel to Luin. I swear I'll restore the city. The buster. I was starting Luin to the busting silly well it once was. Yep, okay. They're gonna go back there. Thank you. Alright, that's done. 
Maybe again, because I'm paranoid. By the way, how are we going to get to the power of salvation? You have to cross the mountains. I know. What is it? Dragon tour guy. We'll ask him to lend us some of his dragons. Dragon should be able to go through the powers of salvation. I see, that's a good idea. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna say no right there. Because if I go there, then game over. This is my chance to get into some shit. My chance to get into some shit. This is going to be a piece of cake! I'm going to get played in. We're have a refeed yesterday. Nope, okay, like cool. Was that... Damn it, can I get the loot in peace? This is gonna be a piece of cake! I wanna use a holy battle, okay. that's the pussy's way out. I was just warming up. Okay, it's right there. Nice sight. No. Not much of a specimen. <laughs> Pretty good. Demon for the white spear. That was just warming up. Just really reach. I didn't get attacked. Yay! Alright. Let's go. Try to make this long ass journey. Back to Palma Costa. Jesus, y'all really want some of that booty, huh? Jeez. Oh. That booty's not for you. Okay. So there's definitely a few things that I want to try and do before we get too serious. Already got Undine. Damn it. Not much of a specimen. No way! I'm gonna try and get Sif last. That's gonna be the hardest part. Besides the Tower of Salvation. That was just warming up. I'm gonna try and get the Dirk. See if I can get my hands on those items. Yeah, relax, Snickle Toes. Don't be on the bridge, don't be on the bridge. You're outside the bridge. 
You're in for a world of hurt. Yeah, you have to cheat and pin me on the wood. Never stood a chance. All right, so basically, let me get to town, and then I look at my notes and see what the game plan is gonna be. I know for sure I ought to do self last. Alright, so we're doing self last for sure. We already healed Pietro. We're gonna try and fight the sword dancer. We already did the spirits of statue. Dirk is the only thing. I'm gonna do him first. Because we're gonna be backtracking anyway from there. Next house. Alright, so the red is us, the white is the destination. So we gotta find a boat to get us there. Actually, from the looks of it, it looks like there's a path that goes down there. But I don't know if there's, like, a way around the mountains. Alright, Vesalia, Grant. Yeah, there's definitely a way. Yeah, it's that path to get to the... The what you call it. Yes, I went the, com I went the freaking long way for no reason. Alright, do I have to do anything here? Nope. Alright. So freaking take our asses back the other way. Yep, take me to Mount Hydro. Yep, thank you. <coughs> Wait, do you need a transport? Nope. Alright, so now I just basically have to get to Luin and take the t take the transfer to Hema. Damn it, I didn't see that. You're in for a world of hurt. We're gonna walk our happy asses across that bridge. <laughs> Was that a bit? Cause like I said, self is gonna be last, so we can't. I don't want to go to Ishgard. Ish Pietro. Now we built the city for those who were killed as well. In order to accomplish that, I need both people and money. Uh. That's probably the only bit of money I'm going to give. Sure there's like a whole side quest dedicated to rebuilding the city with him. Alright, we're at Hema. Go back outside Hema. Take 
can't get on Noish. So now we gotta walk. But the caravan's here, so make it for the caravan. Of course, there's an enemy right in front of the caravan. Of course, there's a grasshopper. What's up, buddies? There's no reason to go there at all. Unless I wanted to go over the clues about Asuka again. Damn it. Don't get too comfortable. Light photon. To the continent. I'm the starting one. Come on. You're in for a world of hurt. <laughs> I mean, you do one damage on guys. So. <laughs> Was that a bitch? But I can write on noise now, so yay! Yo, you know you're too weak to be attacking me like this. Calm down. I got to that mountain path. Alright, that's where the sword dancer is, but we're not going there yet. You're in for a world of hurt. <laughs> Alright, these are still slightly strong enough to do more than one damage to me. Never stood a chance. Damn it. One fight after another. <laughs> Even Rain's complaining about the continuous fight. Did I just level up? Yep. Alright, he, he literally went out of his way to grab me. Wish these fools would chill. Don't get too comfortable. Why are you getting first aided? Blame your fate. Hey, can I get out of here without? Should have had like a special scene right there. 
And when you have uh, Sheena in your party, I accept the light. Remember when you fell in through here? <laughs> Gonna be a piece of cake. Too. <laughs> critical damage is still No way. Photon. That's it. How's this getting started? So I can't ride noise in the desert. It's annoying. Is that the home? Yes, that's the home. Yep, that's his area. XM level three Metal Sphere Onion X Sphere Shard Alright, so we got the items with these x spheres on. Eternal, add combo, guard plus, spirit. Alright, so I'm keeping personal because it keeps me walking. Vitality, tough just gives me defense, which, I mean, isn't bad. get another sh another shard to get that. I don't remember what to do with that. We got that. We got a metal sphere. Alright, we're good. We came all the way back just for that. I mean, one hit to my combo is a lot better than the current we have. Wish there was a shortcut, man. Damn. 
damn it. Not much of a specimen. <laughs> that was disappointing. Every turn. Not much of a specimen. I can just die so we can move forward, please. Thank you. you. Like that? Overconfidence breeds carelessness. You need to focus. Uh, I'm sorry. Man. Happy you guys care and all, but Jesus. They're like low level mobs. Don't gang up on Lloyd for that. I get it, you can be extremely cocky sometimes. Jeez. Alright, off to the desert. Don't get too comfortable. <laughs> Take! Take! Light! Photon! <laughs> <laughs> Was that a bit? Hate the fact that you go uphill, the camera just slopes down. You can't control this camera all that well. This is gonna be a piece of cake. <laughs> then again, it's an old game. You can't really. Compare all that much about that. All right. Excuse me. You know, like the old adage says, "It is what it is." I wish I could just jump in there. Alright, so we gotta get through all of these guys. Damn it. Don't get too comfortable. <laughs> Never stood a chance. You're in for a world of hurt. No way. Yeah, I wouldn't complain too much about fighting. If they would have just incorporated that thing that the mirror game has. If they would have just thought of it, you know, a couple of years earlier. Where, you know, you can link the enemies on the field. And you can get one big battle. That would have been fine. I would have been happy with that. Don't get too comfortable. Work. Sonic Thrust. Light. Photon. Take. <laughs> That's it? I was just getting st Alright, can we get to the cave? Please. There we go. I feel like I'm gonna regret it, but if I lose, I gotta make that long walk back. Let's go all out! Fire speed! How do I 
Firewood sight! Tower! Don't overdo it! You first aid! No way! Are you okay? Don't overdo it! First aid! Sonic sword ring! No way! Are you okay? First aid! Okay! No way! Are you okay? First aid! Don't overdo it! First aid. All right, so this isn't gonna be that bad of a fight. If we would have fought him when I first, when I first encountered him, we would have definitely got spanked. But you know, after beating Undine and getting as far as we have, this is a freaking cakewalk. Uh, Are you okay? First aid. Don't overdo it. First aid. Are you no okay? Don't overdo it! First aid! And he's down you for the count! The guy to mess with. Dude, all that for an x fear level 1? You should've just killed them when we first started. Got a mirror. But we have an extra axe sphere, so who needs it? For those who don't know, you'll find out shortly the whole reason why I'm not equipping like anything exponential on Kratos. Look at the Sheena. task is done. Killed the sword dancer. This is gonna be a piece of cake. <laughs> That was disappointing. Alright, all that's basically left is the Tower of Salvation and Self. And we're doing Self before the Tower of Salvation, so. Don't get too comfortable. Are you okay? First aid! No way! That was disappointing. Pointing the camera down, please. Not much of a specimen. Light photon. Sonic thrust. That was just warming up. Yeah, let me see if I remember this correctly. The run map. Alright, so I gotta go just before... I gotta go just before the mountain pass to go to stuff, get self. I can't remember exactly where the temple was.
you're in for a world of hurt. Okay, that that wasn't just me hearing that, right? So the ogres have freaking some weird injured dog sound. No way! Was that a bit too much? Genius, really? You feel that making a sandwich? We have all the ingredients. You have three stars in making sandwiches. Shouldn't be failing at making sandwiches, Jesus. Oh shit. Didn't realize I had that much money. I'll give him some more. It would only let me give him two. It would only let me give him five, uh, two grand. For some reason, I'm gonna give him a lot more. That's I gave him ten grand. Hopefully he makes some progress. Jesus. See it, it's in sight. Leave me alone. Come on. Don't get too focus. comfortable. Get in there. Let's see what we can do against self. <clears throat> Go see if we can get any upgrades for anybody. And sure, let's get two of those. Let's see, Gramps, what do you got?
Need black silver. Check. Nothing. 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 Think about the two hundred dollars shit. Which way I got last six hundred. Alright, hit the end, save. Yep, hit the end, save, and then let's go fight old dickhead. Actually, I'm gonna save at the more expensive one. Safe point. fucking ruins. Cause that's where they sealed the calamity and not the lemon spirit. on the other side. A 
I should have saw that coming. This is gonna be a piece of cake. Take! Take! Like Sonic thrust! Take! Light! Photon! Take! Take! Blame your fate. Yeah, you know, I really wish I had a better sword for, some better swords for Lloyd. Go fast, let's go. We're counting on you with Sylph. All right, let's go. Also, we'll learn later on, after the new year, why Sheena is afraid of Seven Spirits, if you don't already know. A summoner, are you not? We the Sylph already share a pact with Mythos. I forgot Sylph was three beings in this game. <laughs> I am Sheena. I ask that thou annulst thy pact with Mythos and establish a new pact with me. Ah, so the next pact maker's finally here. Okay then, we'll test out your power! Not even warning. Let's go all out. Are you okay? Demon you will overdo it. Jake, she is dead. You're ready! You're ready! There, copper! Ready? 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 Are you ready? You okay? Ready? No way! Take this! First day! Sorry. Oh, Sheena, pick me up. Careful. Uh, 
Annoying. You okay? I call upon the Navy of the Mist. Can I summon me? Come, Undini. There. Ready? What we got? What we got? Alright, cool. Alright, now we have a chance. You okay? Spring! Back this door! Uh, hey. Sorry! Resurrection! Uh, you okay? Now we have a chance. We took the work. We took the magical range away. Overdo it. All right, we took the magical range away. We took the physical DPS away. Now all that's left is the physical range. Brother, are you okay? No way. Take this. Don't oh, she can do fucking blue. Oh, Don't overdo it. Aren't we close? Don't overdo it. Okay. First Okay. Don't overdo it. Are you okay? First sword No way. Take this. First Are you okay? First day. All right. We killed self first try. I was just getting started. I thought we were gonna wipe there for a second. Jesus. We got our second pack. Next is the Tower of Salvation. I'm impressed too. Yes, you shall have what you seek. Now make your vow. Right now, at this very moment, there are people who are suffering. I vow to save those people. Understood. But please, keep to your vow. We do not wish to be betrayed again. But you see? I caught my mistake early. And I corrected that shit. That's I that's two hundred IQ level share right there. Don't get too comfortable. No way. Are you okay? I got it. Nurse. Thank Demon you. Even better fight speed. No way. Work. Sonic thrust. I forgot how Nurse looks in this in this game. Demon better. Don't get in my way. Don't get in my way. Like he has like four nurses running across the screen. <laughs> It's just funny. All right. Shit.
<laughs> Lloyd is literally me when it comes to certain things. This is gonna be a piece of cake. Anything, so like, yeah. 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 You ain't going nowhere. What's wrong? You're gonna see him. Help is on the way. Nurse. I was just warming up. Okay, go back across the bridge. And shortcut our way to Hema. And hit the Tower of Salvation. Shit, really? <laughs> Don't get too comfortable. Ready? Power seal! Like that! Power seal! Are you okay? At least it's not every time anymore. Alright! Okay, let me just get the Luin in peace, please. I'm just getting Luin in peace. There we go. Yeah, Troy, you lazy bum. Not giving you any more money. I right, gave you ten grand. I only have two grand left for myself. Yes, let's go to Hino. Let's go! I hit the end. And here I thought this part C was going to be really short. I was wrong. Let's get us some dragons and get going.
we're finally down to the last seal. Let's split up for tonight. But don't go outside the village, understood? Yup. Got it. We'll be leaving in the morning. Good night, everyone. Sleep well. You want to thank me? Don't worry about it. Despite knowing what your future holds, this is all I can do for you. Tomorrow, Silverant will be saved. What are you gonna do? Good question. Well, the only thing I can do is believe in the Chosen. The Chosen from this side seems to be trustworthy enough. What's that mean? Is there a Chosen you can't trust? <sighs> Tetheala's is Chosen. I can't stand that guy. I see. Tetheala has a Chosen too. Two worlds, two Chosen. If there really is a goddess, why did she make a world like this? Yeah, no kidding. I want to kick her for doing this. <laughs> Seriously? I wish I could do that myself. Your journey is finally coming to an end. This isn't the end I hoped for. Really? It's the journey you started by clinging to the Chosen. This was to be expected. Clinging to the Chosen? Don't you remember? It was you who said we have the Chosen on our side. The Savior who will regenerate the world. Yeah, that's right. I said that. And that's why I have to protect her. If relying and depending on the power of the Chosen at the most crucial time is what it means to protect her, then the meaning of the word protect must have changed significantly from my understanding. And now, the Chosen is trying to resolve everything by sacrificing herself. What are you trying to say? Lloyd, don't make a mistake. I don't quite get it, but I got it. But hey, if I make a mistake, can't I just do it over again? Hmm. <laughs> do it over. If it's something you can do over again, then feel free.
go see Colette. This is her last night. Last night? It's her last night as a human. Professor, you're a scholar, right? Can't we do anything? Don't you understand yet? You're not too bright. It's because I'm a scholar that I'm fascinated by Colette as she continues to transform into an angel. You can't be serious, Professor. You think so? Now go to her. Salvation is so close now. We've come quite a long way. Yeah. It's at a time like so. I went that whole time with the mic muted. So, yeah. You know, playing so many witty things. Yeah. You know, talking about how. Colette is soccer a deer. Yeah. Counting off this checklist, making sure that that I hit everything, like healing Pietro, getting the unicorn, killing the blade dancer, doing the statue of Spirita, you know, getting Sylph and Undine, getting the EX gem level three, you know, doing the last training with Kratos. The final and last training with Kratos. And then when Lloyd called him Master, and he said, Thank you, Master. I was reading that part out loud, and I somehow said, Thank you, Massa. Which shouldn't have been said. <laughs> but, you know. You know. I... I punished myself by going full weeb. Yeah, definitely, definitely went full weeb. With the whole Origato Hosaimas Masa. And Origato Hosaimas Senpai. Why? I don't know. This has definitely been a fun time for me. Reliving. Because I don't even know if the way things have turned out is good or bad. Reliving Tales of Symphonia with an audience. So if you guys really did have enjoyed it, you know, leave a like. Leave down in the comments how much you actually like it. But don't forget that this is the last episode until after the new year. So just keep that in mind. Well, no one knows that. The ones who think they do are the stupid ones. You think so? Definitely. I guess you're right. You say some cool things every now and then. Thanks, Lloyd. talk to uh, Colette because they didn't make Sheena they didn't make Sheena the main waifu in the game which is hard setting super upsetting this is waifu this right here is waifu this aren't I going to see the others is Colette the Sakura trash tier character of this game. <coughs> yeah. Alright, so we talked to Rain, we talked to Genus, we talked to Waifu, we talked to Kratos. 
So she the only well, aren't one I left. going to? No, it's okay. Let's talk for a bit. You can write. The world regeneration. It's almost time. I'm sorry? Why are you apologizing? This is the end, and yet I can't even speak. I know that's weird. Uh, let me fix this real quick. Whatever. Just make do with what it is. Can't really m complain too much. Background noise is background noise, you know? Yeah, no. You dork. That doesn't matter. No matter what happens to you, you're still you. Now I really have to check this. <coughs> yeah, that should have fixed it. Hopefully. Even if you become an angel, even if you become like marble, I won't ever think you're weird. Ever. He's only saying that because he wants some of that booty. Anyway, I'm the one that has to apologize. Even though I promised I'd make you that gift before our journey ended, I kept thinking we still had a ways to go. I never even got close to finishing it. I'll wait forever. Even after I become an angel, I'll keep on waiting. You can give it to me anytime. Okay, this time I'm really going to make it, no matter how long it takes. Can Are I you ask though? you one last thing? <coughs> Are you sure you won't regret this? Are you sure you want to become an angel? The truth is, I'm a little scared. Yeah, I would be too. But if giving up my life as a human means that Silverant will be reborn, then it's almost like my life is spreading out to fill the entire world. When I think about it like that, I'm okay. You're strong, Colette. <sighs> the wind's pretty cold. Let's go back to the inn. Ah, uh, sorry. 
That's right, you can't feel it. Damn it, isn't there anything we can do? There's always something you can do, Lloyd. Always. was Kratos, wasn't it? Where's he going? You'll have to continue watching over Lloyd for me. Oh, snap. The truth is coming together, surely. Slowly. Slowly, it's slowly coming together. <laughs> Noise, you little fuck. You knew who he was the whole time. You didn't even say anything. I have things I must do. In my place, I need you to. Kratos, look out! Uh, stop! Kratos, are you okay? Lloyd, thank you. Uh, I was nothing. But who was that? Lloyd, you know who that is. You run into him already. I would imagine it's that assassin. He managed to get away, but I gave him an injury he'll not soon forget. I have a feeling I've seen him somewhere before. You have, Lloyd? Incredible. Yes, perhaps. Let's get back to the inn. Everyone's probably up. Yeah. Lloyd. Hmm? What is it? Don't die. What? Yeah. Okay. Well, what's up all of a sudden? Don't worry about it. How can he tell me not to worry after saying something like that? What's this? There's some strange letters carved into it. Early time. Time to go flying on some dragons. Time for me to save my game. Orin's happy. Game saved. Time to go into the nonsense of the next part. I already finished everything that I needed to do, Rain. I'm happy that you're uh, that you're watching out for me. I finished everything I needed to do. I'm right on the dragon. Those are more wyverns than dragons. Um, obviously Sheena. Yeah, she's okay with it. She was really excited about it. Sit in front of me if I can hold her. <laughs> Almost time. 
then the world will be regenerated, and Tethayala will at least trust Colette. I'm sure she'll ask Remiel how we can save both worlds. Yes, Colette wouldn't have been Tethayala. I'll trust her. What? You can do it. I think the first time I ever did this, I picked Rain. Or Genus, because he was. Where are Colette there. and the others? Looks like they've gone in already. Let's hurry up. Those must be coffins. Where are all these bodies here? They must be all the chosen that failed the world regeneration until now. Though Colette fails, she'll wind up here with them. Damn it! I'm worried about Colette. Let's hurry. Yeah! What? what? This is giving me some fucking Sephiroth killing Aeris vibes. Now, my daughter, release the final seal. Now, my daughter, release the final seal. So I can stab you like Sephiroth did Aerith. In doing so, you will complete the final sacrifice of your human existence, your heart, and your memory. By doing so of your own free will, you will become a true angel. What? Sacrifice her heart and memory? Colette's going to forget about us? Colette's human life will now end, and she will be reborn as an angel. Professor Sage, what is he talking about? Lloyd, I'm sorry. I promised Colette I wouldn't say anything. Colette will give up her life in order to regenerate the world. Becoming an angel means dying. That's not quite correct. The Chosen's heart will die, and her body will be offered to the goddess Martell. By offering her body, Colette will revive the goddess. This is the true nature of the world regeneration. The revival of the goddess Martell is the revival of the world itself. That... that's... Lord Remiel. We have heard that a world known as Tethayala lies parallel to Silverant. That is not for you to know. You kept it a secret because it is true, correct? Shit's about to get real, guys. I haven't gone the... Uh, restock on my gear yet. My items and such. We have three battles ahead of us. Three boss battles. From whom did you learn of it? Can't Crucius make both worlds peaceful? If that is what the Chosen desires, she can lend her power to Crucius by becoming an angel. Once the goddess Martell is revived by the Chosen, the two worlds will surely achieve peace, just as the Chosen wishes. <gasps> but how would that happen if she forgets her... Her memories and shit. How oh, is she supposed to remember that she wants the two worlds to be at peace? Is that true, you ask? You know why you have come here. You can't! Are you really planning to die? Colette, stop! If you sacrifice yourself, 
your friends who love you, and your family, and... and me. We'll all be sad. It'll be the same as sacrificing all of us. <gasps> Genus, let me go! I don't want anything to happen to her either. But what else are we supposed to do? The people of Silverun are suffering too. But... The sacrifice of one single person, the Chosen, will save the world. Will it though? Are you saying that you would choose the Chosen Soul over the entire world? I mean... You're not supposed to sacrifice one for the many or the many for one, so... Now, Colette, come join your father. Wait! Remy, is there really no other way? Colette's your daughter! Surely you don't really want her to die either! My daughter? Don't make me laugh. When I came down to play the role of Guardian Angel, you inferior beings just started calling me her father on your own. Wha what I merely placed the Crucius Crystal upon this sacrifice, who was selected to become Martel's vessel. Colette! Lloyd, it's okay. I realized what was going on. Every time I met Remuel, I felt that he was not my real father. But still, for some reason, I still feel like I want to cry. Colette, if you realize what was going on, then why... You can hear my voice? I'm so happy! I'll be able to say goodbye to you in the end. Colette, I'm sorry. I couldn't save you. I'm so sorry. <clears throat> I promised I wouldn't make another mistake, but it looks like I have again. No. Thank you, Lloyd. Because of you, I was able to find the courage to protect the world. Because of you, I was able to find the strength to live these 16 years to the fullest. So please... Colette! It looks like... it's time. Goodbye. Yeah, Colette's 16. I just thought she was like 12, 14. I've played this game so many times and I just overlooked the fact that she says she's 16. <coughs> Let learn judgment. Colette also lost her humanity. He has no soul. <laughs> I've done it. It's finally complete. Martel's vessel is finally complete. With this, I shall become one of the four Seraphim. You will become... Dirt. On my fucking boot. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Wait just a minute! What are you gonna do with Colette? He's going to take her to heaven. This thing is heaven in this game. Bastard! You'll pay for this! Crucius, the angels, the goddess Martel. It's all a big lie, isn't it? Let her go! Now! That I cannot do. For she is Martel's vessel. This is Martel's new body, which took years to complete. I have no more use for any of you. Be gone! Yep, here we go. I have no further need of you. Be gone. <laughs> there! Oh, no. Punishment! There! Oh, God. Oh, here we go! Oh. Fire seal! Fire seal! Fire seal. Fireball! Take! <laughs> You ready for this? Rush! Are you okay? Are you okay? Corruption! 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 
Yes, I know what you're doing right now. You're using your stupid arrows to attack the mages. I'm trying not to let that happen. Heal me, people. Heal me. Okay, took almost 10, 10k off his health already. Oh crap. Alright, Rain, you're just about to finish that cast. Pick me up. You picked me up just in time for Nurse to stay here. Looks like I gotta go check on something. All right, the life of a dad, making videos and live streaming, making sure the bad boys oh, here go. Oh yes! There we go. One of my favorite moves right there. Heavy tiger Ready? Alright, where are we at now? Yeah, 700 health. Are you okay? First day. Oh, that to the nice cost. Boom. Power lose. No one was dead at the end. In the title, Magic Cycle. I prepared the sandwich, not Genus. Okay. Impossible. How can an angel, the ultimate being, lose to a group of humans? Because you're not an ultimate being. Colette, come back to us! I'm going to restore you back to your normal self, I promise! Colette, have you really forgotten me? You're wasting your time. Not only did she lose her memory, but she has lost the soul to listen to your words. Told you. She is no longer human. Now Colette is merely a puppet standing before death's door. Kratos! Where have you been? What are you saying? The Chosen desired the regeneration of the world and chose this path herself. By the summoning of the Chosen to Daris Karlon, the seal will be broken and the regeneration will be complete. Kratos, what are you talking about? It is what you wanted as well. We will take the Chosen as the new body for Martel. What are you talking about? Kratos, answer me! Master, answer me! Lord Kratos, have pity on me. Please, lend me your aid. Fuck you, Ramiel. Have you forgotten, Ramiel? I was once of the inferior race, a human. Does the ultimate being seek help from that which he despises the most? <laughs> Move out of the way. Kratos... Who are you? I am of Crucius, the organization that guides this world. I am one of the four Seraphim, 
sent forth to keep close watch over the chosen. So for those of you guys who whose first time this is watching this. Did you start catching on to the fact that he wasn't really on our side? If not, that's okay. There's still another secret. If you cut on to that secret, you know, you're good. I'll, I'll give you the pass for not getting the angel secret. But if you didn't, if you haven't cut on to either of them, start paying more attention. Kratos is an angel too. You deceived us. Deceived. If the Chosen merges with Martell, she will awaken, and the world will be saved. Is that not what you wanted? Once her body is taken by the goddess Martell, Colette will truly die. No. She will be reborn as Martell. It'll be Martell, not Colette, so Rain was right that she will truly die. Damn it! You think I'm gonna let you do that? Colette is our friend! Okay, let's be honest here, Lloyd. Colette, yes, she is a friend, but you're doing it because you want some of that booty. You earnestly believe you can defeat okay. me? Here we go. Blade. Fire seal. Heavy tiger blade. Aqua edge. Ah. 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 I forgot that he can combo everything. <laughs> Help is on the way. Nurse! Watch out, okay? Watch out! Out of my sight! Seal. No way! Pancakes! Are you okay? The lag might! Fight Spear! Fight Tempest! No way! Spear. You okay? Ready? I mean, okay, we're still doing a decent amount of damage. First Brave. Shit. Yeah. He's fucked. Charge! Thunderblade! Lightning blade! Spear! I just healed it. I just brought her back to life. Damn it! You okay? Fierce demon Of course that happens. Are you okay? Lightning blade, white spear. Heavy tiger blade. Spear. Heavy tiger blade. Spear. Are you okay? Okay. Fierce demon, white spear. Are you okay? Lightning blade. Lightning blade. Lightning blade. Lightning blade. You okay? Brave. Lightning blade. No way. Lightning blade. Are you okay? Lightning blade, Dude, the freaking combos, man. Ah, watch out, okay? 
lightning blade, flame <laughs> spear. Rush, like fire seal. Blade. Speed. Fire seal. Fear. Fierce demon Damn. fang. Fear. Steaming Fang. Be careful. Blade. Oh, Light Spear. Sorry. Blade. <laughs> Lightning Blade. Light Spear. Fuck. You cannot oppose. F I really wanted to beat him because this is a win or lose fight. I wanted to get two wins under my belt because the third fight is a lose regardless of anything. Uh, well, this is why Kratos is so good. He can combo everything so well. <coughs> See, he flows perfectly. I don't like using him, but he f he flows perfectly when you have him set up properly, just like he just did. <sighs> and here's the last boss. I guess not even you could bring yourself to fight against such an opponent. Lord Yggdrasil. Yggdrasil. Who's that? Another angel? Are you Lloyd? Give me your name and I'll give you mine. <laughs> People need not introduce themselves to a dog. What did you say? Fine. I shall tell you my name, wretched human. I am Eugdrasil, leader of Crucius, and the Desions. Oh, we're I'll show to lose you the meaning anyway, of true so power. Die, Holy Lance! <laughs> you really do one damage to him, so what's the point? How sad. The conditions for that fight are last two minutes, do 10,000 damage, or just lose. Kratos, I trust you have no objections? <sighs> Farewell. Chosen has already become an angel. We have no choice. We're taking her back with us alive. They grab Lloyd. What about everybody else? Renegades, as irritating as ever. Still, it is of little consequence. Kratos, let us leave. As you wish. Hmm. Saved by the renegades. Don't die, Lloyd. Lloyd, you're finally awake! Uh... Where are we? Where's Colette? She doesn't respond to anything we say. Damn it! Lloyd, do you remember this place? We're in Triet Desert, remember? This is the base where you were captured before. The Desion base? 
These guys aren't designs. What? So many things happened at once. I'm confused too. Then why don't we go over everything we know about the situation as it stands now? First, our current situation. When we were about to be killed in the Tower of Salvation, we were rescued by the organization on this base that resembles the Designs. They call themselves the Renegades. Uh, so what you're saying is that... The people here are called Renegades and not Designs? I really don't get it, but go on. It seems that the Renegades oppose the Designs. They probably have a reason for intentionally trying to look like Designs. Alright, I think I get it now. We were saved by an organization called the Renegades that looks a lot like the Designs. So then, who was that angel guy? You Drassil or whatever. And what about Kratos? Do you remember you Drassil's words? This is just pure conjecture, but... Crucius, holy beings worshipped by the Church of Martell, and the Designs may in fact be the same organization. Whoa, wait. What? How could that be possible? Lloyd, hear me out. If we think of the Designs as a part of Crucius, or perhaps their pawns, everything makes sense. I remember one of the Design Five Grand Cardinals said that their boss was Eugdrasio. And Eugdrasil said that he was the leader of Crucius and the Designs when he appeared before us. If the Designs and Crucius are the same, well then what about Crucius? He obeyed Eugdrasil's orders. That means... That's right. He's our enemy. He deceived us. He admitted it himself. He's one of Crucius's four seraphim. Kratos is likely a subordinate of Eugdrasil. He probably joined us to make sure Colette didn't stray from the journey to regenerate the... So we were deceived from the very beginning. By Remiel, the Crucius, even Kratos! Ah, you're awake. Then please, come with me to the next room. Our leader awaits you. You're finally awake. Are you the Renegades? Correct. We're an underground resistance dedicated to fighting the Designs. Or rather... So Crucius and the Designs really are the same organization? Correct. Crucius controls the Church of Martel in the open, and operates the Designs from behind the scenes. The Designs are a subordinate organization within Crucius. The Church of Martell is nothing more than an instrument created by Crucius to rule the world. Those who call themselves angels are half-elves who have evolved by using a special type of X-Sphere called Crucius Crystals. They aren't gods or anything of the sort. Of course, the Church of Martell and the Chosen know nothing about that. They're half-elves too? Yes. Some of the Designs, as well as Crucius and ourselves, are half-elves. What is Crucius trying to do? Are they doing all of this just to rule the world? Do you intend to have us explain everything? How about using your own head a little? Do they wish to revive the goddess Martell? They send oracles to those of the Mana lineage and control their marriages to create Chosens who become the vessel. It seems meaninglessly drawn out and complicated. Well, well. I am impressed. There is another world beyond Silverant that competes for Mana. Tetheala. Yes. And the one who created this twisted world was Crucius's leader, Eugdrasil. Create a world? That's ridiculous! No one can do that! If that's what you believe, then our conversation ends here. 
Wait, if Yggdrasil was the one that created the two worlds himself, what can you possibly hope to do against someone like that? And that's not all. You tried to kill Colette and me. You're certainly not on our side. And yet for some reason, you saved us. Why? You're not as stupid as you seem. Excuse me? Our goal is to stop Martel's revival. Therefore, the Chosen, who would become her vessel, was an obstacle. Unfortunately, the Chosen completed the Angel transformation. The Chosen is now a lethal weapon whose only goal is self-preservation. We wouldn't dare lay a hand on her. But now we have the key to stop Martel's resurrection. We no longer need the Chosen. What? What we need is you, Lloyd Irving. Me? What's so special about me? That's none of your concern. Get him! Really? We need you, but we won't tell you why we need you. Fuck off. Lord Ewan! No! It's his wound from Hyma. Ugh. Kratos! How many times must you get in my way? Wound from Hyma? Are you telling me the one who attacked Kratos was... Lloyd! What are you doing? Like a little chihuahua trying to attack him. I'll keep playing the way it is. Just... Let's do the ease. Okay, let's play the mic. Step hallway.
better than nothing. Just I'm stacked up a bit. Okay, let's change that. What does it do now? Do Eggerson Zames, get. Alright, we're getting close to the end for for the year, guys. Push hard and get to the end.
we put the metal one back there. I feel like the metal one is more important for that part right there. Grab the chest, and then we'll close that off. X gem level two. Keep your staircase. Something up, I feel like I messed something up. That's what that was, okay. Let's bring that back up. Put those on there. Yeah, okay. Boom. Oh. Bring that back up. <clears throat> And there's no more chests. Go through the door. Damn it! What's so special about me? 
Those renegades need to hurry up and make up their freaking minds about whether they're our enemies or not. Lloyd, what are we going to do now? We've got to save Colette somehow. She's going to die if she's made into Martell's vessel. But what can we do? Sheena, where did you get your X-Sphere? Huh? Well, that came out of nowhere. I got this before I came here. They attached it to me at the Imperial Research Academy. Is it normal for people to equip X-Spheres in Teveala? No, not at all. The technology was originally brought over by the Renegades. Nowadays, X-Spheres are mainly attached to machines. Wait a second. So Tetheala and the Renegades are on the same side? I'm not sure if you could say that. But the Renegades were the ones that brought us information about the nature of the two worlds. And the plan to assassinate the Chosen was their idea. They talked the King and the Pope into it. If you desire for Tetheala to prosper, kill the Chosen of Silveront. That's horrible! Lloyd, I suggest we go to Tetheala. Why Tethe- Don't you remember what Ewan said? Angels are half-elves that evolved using special X-spheres called Crucius Crystals. Oh, I get it. Colette's current condition is caused by the Crucius Crystal. Since Tethayala is studying the X-spheres, they may know something about Crucius Crystals as well. That's a good idea. I'm pretty sure that they're studying the Crucius Crystal that belongs to Tethayala's Chosen at the Imperial Research Academy. There's a Chosen in Tethayala too? Of course. The world regeneration ritual is carried out in Tetheala as well. The Church of Martell exists too. But if they've been carrying out the regeneration that many times, why hasn't Martell's vessel been completed already? I'm curious about that myself. Perhaps those corpses lined up in the Tower of Salvation were... No, never mind. They were failed experiments, that's what they were. Yeah, there are too many things that we don't know. Crucius' objective? The Renegades? The method to save Colette? So let's just start with what we can do now. So, we're going to Tetheala? Yeah. That's the only lead we have right now. And this time, I'm going to fulfill my role. I'm not going to let Colette bear the burden all by herself anymore. Wait a minute. That's great and all, but how are we going to get to Tepeala? I'm sure Sheena knows how to get there, correct? My understanding is that you can travel to Tepeala by passing through a distortion in space. As far as I know, crafts called Riards are the only things that can do that. Yeah, we finally got our Riards. Where are they? The Renegades should have them. They should be somewhere on this base. Okay then, let's get going. Fights left, so it's just getting to the reards at this point. And they should be right here. Yeah. So these are the Riards. Hurry, they'll catch up to us. All right then, Tefeola, here we come. If anybody's ever watched season three of Digimon Adventures, Digimon Tamers, 
this reminds me of that thing that Giyomon uses when uh, when he Mega Digivolves or Matrix Digivolves or whatever the fuck it's called. What's that thing called? Granny. Yeah, that the Riards remind me of Granny, Gallant Mon's Mount. The cutscene begins. After this cutscene, guys, this is where we part ways for the rest of the year. I'm joking. This is where we part ways until after the new year. When we get to that save point after the cutscene, we're good. Whoa! Wait, where's Kawhi? What's happening? I don't know. It just suddenly... Look, the fuel gauge is empty. So that's it. Since you've broken the seals in Silverant, there's not enough mana in this world. And that means... We're gonna fall! Ah! Ah! Genus... Genus's cry sounds so fake, man. I think we managed to avoid destroying them completely. Useless unless we get some fuel. What's the fuel? Coal? Coal? Oh, jeez. How do you guys manage to actually live in Silverant? Then magic, I assume. Perhaps the lightning that Volt produces? Then all we have to do is have Sheena summon Volt, right? I haven't made a pact with Volt. Oh. Well, then I guess we'll just have to leave these here. Oh. And here I thought Magi technology was infallible. Hey, what's that? That's the Tower of Salvation. Why is that here? This is Tefeala, right? Of course. The Tower of Salvation appears in the Flourishing World. The Tower also appeared on your side after Colette received the Oracle, right? Two worlds. Two towers. Well, it's technically one world split in two with one tower that phases between the two dimensions. What about the Holy Ground? The Church of Martell is also over here, correct? Is the Holy Ground called Carlon? Yes. The place where the Tower of Salvation lies is the Holy Ground of Carlon. The same is in your world. The Holy Ground of Carlon is where the peace treaty was signed to end the ancient war. There can't be two of them. Are you sure yours isn't a fake? We have records in our museums that depict how the hero Mythos called the two ancient kings to the holy ground of Carlon in order to forge a peace treaty. And such records exist on our side as well. Instruments used to sign the treaty can be found in the Palma Costa Academy. So either one side is fake, or maybe they're actually both real. Lloyd, that's not possible. Don't get mad, I was just kind of saying I mean, stuff. It is possible if you look at it where Tetheala was one of the kingdoms and Silverant was the other kingdom. And Mythos came to bring peace to both. And then Udrasil fucked up and, you know, made the fucked up world we have now. But that's just theory, a game theory. Anyway, let's get going. Cringe. It's true we aren't going to get anywhere by pondering about it here. Wow, it's our first adventure in Tetheala. Genus, this isn't a field trip. You even got the achievement cleared over on.
Safe point. Safe point. Safe point. Where you be? Safe point. There you are. All right. My fellow Kuzuins. It is officially. It is officially the end of Tales of Symphonia for 2019. I hope you guys have enjoyed the journey with me. This video comes out before Christmas. So, keep in mind that next week, which is the week of Christmas, there will be no Tales of Symphonia. Tales of Symphonia will return after New Year's. So, to fill the gap, make sure you catch me on my streams. Tuesday, Thursdays, I'll try and throw in a Friday stream as well, when I can. Friday streams are going to be for fun. Tuesday, Thursday is going to be, you know, anything else that I need to record or do. So, again, thank you for watching. Thank you for being one of those faithful subscribers or faithful viewers. It means a lot. Come back next year and enjoy the ride again for part B of the story. Have yourself a happy holiday. This has been Kuzu. I will see you guys next time. Peace.